Hey, uh, I want to um, speak about how blogs and vlogs could allegedly, I say allegedly for a reason, because I don't know if this is true or not. I'm just putting two and two together. Based on history, in Chicago and other places now, when people die, the enemies take credit indirectly. Now, listen to this. Okay, first of all, if Tukaville Tuka Rose's family see this, I, I don't mean to disrespect your son. I'm trying to fight for your son, okay? Check this out, okay? This is 800. They're a gang out of Chicago on the south side, I think. All right. I don't even speak on SHIT. I don't even speak on stuff. But don't ever taunt 800 shooting interviews and videos on my block. LOL. Y'all see the outcome. Last boys. Grieve in peace, though. Stupid effing dummies. 800 Big Mike said it best. Now, I don't even know why they're trying to put 800 Big Mike in that situation. He's a guy in his 30s. He's in a wheelchair. But he's like an OG on that block. What, the, what he's referring to is this. Um, a blogger. Is, all right, this is called vlogging. Now, the video is basically just some guys who rap from a gang called Taekwon World shooting a music video in, eight, in a hood called 800. And in the video, they're basically, you see the cameraman, you see them just fooling around and, you know, getting excited because they're in their enemy's hood. And according to this Instagram post, that is the reason why Tukaville Rose may have died. I don't know. All I can do, okay, so just look at your, put yourself in my position. The gang, some random gang, that this gang just shot a music video in their hood just to toy with them and taunt them. He's saying on his own Instagram, don't shoot videos on my block, this is what happens. Right after this guy dies. And this is why I tell people, vlogs can get you killed. See, the new thing in Chicago and all over the world is, go to the, go to the trenches, which is the ghetto, the hood. Go to the trenches with a camera and just film the guys who are gang members. Just film them in their everyday life. You know, they're standing in front of a house, rolling up, talking about uh, street stories, war stories, whatever. That's the new thing. People like that because they get to see these guys in their natural environment. You know, they, they get a chance to see them outside of the music videos. They get a chance to see them in everyday life. And people are very curious about how gang members live because they're so damn violent. But rest in peace to Tukaville Rose. And like I said, man, if you're a vlogger or, or you blog about these Chicago gangs, don't record yourself. Why are you making videos of these guys dissing another gang? You know they're gonna, you know somebody's going to get killed because of that. So please, man, you got a responsibility to keep these kids safe. Don't help them crash out. They do a good, good enough job with that on their own. Peace. Rest in peace to that boy.